Hey, what's up? It's Chanel. Welcome to a new episode of Vinyl Vinyl Black. And today we're going to be blasting the mighty dead congregation, Sombre Doom, killer, blasphemous, Greek, death, fucking metal. This mini LP is absolutely amazing. Sombre Doom is also pretty cool because you can listen to it two different ways. You could start with the Doom track and then go into the straight up death metal track or start with the death metal track and then end with the Doom track. It's fucking sick. Redemptive Immolation and Windsbane. This is amazing, amazing stuff. I fucking love Dead Congregation. Cannot wait for Stardust Fest. I have a gnarly toothache right now that's causing like a migraine, so I do apologize if I'm not super enthused or anything like that. I'm just super stoked to go over what I'm going to be going over, but uh, yeah, Dead Congregation. Finally getting to see them live after they played with Pissgrave in New York, but I could not get a ride to St. Vitus. I'm still kicking myself in the ass, but they're playing Stardust with like a Vulcan and Fetid, so it's going to be fucking dope. And I have to thank John Randall down in Florida for fucking sending this next one over. First off, Texan death metal is sick as fuck. Blasphemian, for example, like, hell yeah. Now, also, the new imprecation, Damnado Ab Bestius, is probably the most crushing slab of blasphemous death metal you are going to hear in 2019. I do not know how a band is going to one-up this Lyrically, when it comes to how fucking evil the lyrical content is here. Look at how big that invisible fucking watermelon is or whatever. This is so fucking good. Seriously, like, fuck yeah. Uh, it's serious, it's like Blasphemian. Legit got their hands on whatever Mark McGuire was eating and just were like, you know what, Satan? This is for you. And just absolutely destroyed the altar of Jesus Christ with black phlegm and just riffs from the fucking bowels of hell. This is so fucking good when it comes to just how evil it sounds. Like the vibe alone is just sinister as fuck. And I love how just evil it sounds. Like, wow. And Mark Riddick did a great job right here. I just really like this, like, fucking slimy skeleton holding this upside-down cross. And this is just some really, really over-the-top blasphemous lyrical content. You can check that out for yourself. But remember, this is on Dark Descent Records. A label that, to me, you know, I kind of look at as, like, mostly putting out finished death metal, sick-ass American bands and whatnot that kind of are a little more experimental, like, Blood Incantation, for example. I mean, like, as fucking sick and everything as they are, they're also very experimental, and they make it work. And like Spectral Voice, adding all these atmospheric elements, some electronics, cool shit. Dark Descent one of the best labels in the game because they're not afraid to fuck around with that type of stuff. But just most of the time, I think like, oh, some sick Finnish death metal, you know? Like Gorphelia, Crips, Corpsest, etc, etc. But here we have fucking these five Texan maniacs absolutely destroying the heavens with Damnado Ad Bestius. Like, this is so fucking sick. From Temple of the Foul Spirit all the way to Ageless Ones of None. 
This is a goddamn death metal masterpiece in 2019. There's nothing really too much fucking gnarlier than it right now. Now, pretty much when it comes to death metal in 2019 so far, some of the essentials are leather gloves, perpetual animation, of course, Piss Grave and their new record. And there's a lot more, but right now that's what's out on top of like what I'm listening to. I have like Skull Maggot over there, Skull to Death. I don't know if that's 2018, but fucking great release. But this right here, this slab of fucking blasphemy is just wow. Fucking wow. On just look at this fucking color too. It's just so gnarly looking. Like just the way everything matches up. Like look at how that looks sick as fuck. Awesome stuff. Like Warhead art. Just this is so fucking evil, so heavy. This is everything about death metal that if you're like, you know, super into blasphemous death metal, you fucking need. And if you're just a fan of death metal in general, holy fucking shit, like, yo, this sounds like if Morbid Angel stayed on that covenant path, but like, kind of took some lyrics out of Lord Worm's book instead of making Domination, like, what it became. Now don't get me wrong, I like Domination, but this right here completely decimates Domination by Morbid Angel. Imprecation Damnado Ad Bestias kills most fucking bands. This is death metal gold. Now some of the lyrics might offend some of you, but hey, if you fucking hate Jesus and all that stuff, it's just blasphemy a little bit over the top. And that's one of the sickest things about this is, wow. I don't know what else to say except for you need to get into imp imprecation if you're a fan of heavy, evil death metal. Seriously, I don't really know what else to say besides fuck yeah. This is total evil personified sonically on 12 inches of fucking Dark Descent awesomeness. Hails to Matt for fucking even putting this monster out on wax. Wow. So fucking good. And just, Damnato Ad Bestius was forged in late 2017, early 2018, within the following temples. And as they recorded at a couple places, including the Altar of Hell. But I guess that's in Houston, Texas. But uh, the front cover artwork is by Sebastian Majura. I think he did a. Uh, Corophagrams artwork? I might be wrong. It just looks like his style of uh, demons and stuff. Mark Riddick did this piece. That's what I mean. They really went all out. Warhead did did uh, the sigil. Just sick stuff. Like, seriously. Satanic framework done by the legendary Mark Riddick. That's this piece. It's just fucking wow. Dark Descent went all in because Imprecation went all in on creating some fucking unforgettable, blasphemous death metal. For fans of Christ hating fucking death metal. And this goes after all religions equally, so. No one's spared by the fucking, you know, onslaught here. Wow. Imprecation fucking just absolutely knocked this one out of the park when it comes to evil, 
heavy death metal, and I can't say that enough. Did I mention this is evil? Like, it literally sounds like fucking heaven is being decimated and raped by fucking demons. Are you serious? I'm a fucking demon. <laughs> yeah. So, get into imprecation, damnado ad bestius. Especially if you're a fan of, like, you know, Morbid Angel, Incantation, fucking Blasphyrian. You can't go wrong. Like, just... All I can say is fuck yeah! Seriously! Thank you so much, John, for sending us my way. Imprecation, damn Neto at Bestius on Dark Descent Records. If you're a fan of fucking, you know, death metal, especially the evil kind, you can't go wrong here. Just like you can't go wrong with Dead Congregation. Sombre Doom, this mini LP is just fucking amazing as well. I love it. Get into it. Get in the graves of the Archangels, if anything, if you're new to Dead Congregation. But yeah, if you like Dead Congregation, chances are you're gonna love Imprecation. I know everything kind of rhymes, and I'm sorry, but my tooth is killing me. But as always, thanks for watching, you fucking rule. <laughs>